Another celebrity that defied the bitter cold to attend Sunday night's Chiefs versus Packers game at Lambeau Field was U.S. Olympian Simone Biles. The seven-time Olympian gymnast was spotted on the sidelines in Wisconsin. She is married to Green Bay safety Jonathan Owens. Shortly before kickoff, Biles planted a kiss on her spouse, but on Sunday, Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey's romance took center stage. Swift once more stole the show when she and Brittany Mahomes headed off for Wisconsin to watch her new beau perform for the guests. The build-up to the game was overshadowed by the pop star's visit. But some Lambeau Field fans made it obvious who they supported on Sunday. One was holding a sign with images of Biles and Owens on one side and Swift and Kelsey on the other. A red sign that said, Prohibited, Obscured Swift and Kelsey's Faces. It said, we're not here to see Taylor, we want to see Simone. A Chiefs fan referred to herself as a Mahomie instead of a Swifty in honor of Patrick Mahomes, and a Packers fan paid homage to Biles by using Swift's lyrics. The banner said, shake it off Green Bay, we have Simone Biles, alluding to the popular singer's famous song. In the midst of the snow, Biles stayed warm by donning a Green Bay jacket with Owen's name and number on it. Biles is the most decorated gymnast in history, and she is only 26. Since making her Olympic debut in Rio de Janeiro in 2016, she has won seven medals, including four golds. In May, Owens and Biles celebrated their second marriage in style at an extravagant ceremony held in Cabo San Lucas. Before getting married in Mexico, they had already legally sealed their marriage on April 22nd in Houston, Texas. Biles has been a fixture at her husband's NFL games. She even said that the only benefit of the 2020 Olympics being postponed was that it gave her the opportunity to see him in person. Throughout this NFL season, she has been a devoted wife. She publicly praised Owens on signing with the Packers in May and said she cried her eyes out as he left for training camp.